Okay, I'm going to go through a tutorial today on how to add the Wazala shopping cart option to your site. Uh, Wazala is a great e-commerce tool if you need to add a shopping cart on your site, and we'll be adding tutorials for other options to consider soon as well. So first you want to log into your Wazala account. Um, there are two ways that you'll be able to add the shopping cart, and I'll first show you how to do it using the overlay widget, um, which looks like this. After you set up and configured your account in Wazala and added all of your products, click the Get Widget tab right here. The two options I mentioned are here under Type, and we'll do the Overlay option first. So after you pick the type, you can select the language you want to display your shopping cart in. Uh, you can pick the alignment in terms of where the widget will display on your page, and then you can customize the text that shows on the widget button itself. You can also have your own fully custom design button, but it's a little bit more advanced and I'll link to the instructions for how to do that in this tutorial. The touch button option is mainly for mobile and we'll skip that for now. So once you're done, scroll down and you want to copy the entire embed code here. Then we'll go back over to our website, click admin, and then click the URL custom tracking code option. Although this isn't a tracking code per se, we've tested this and it works well for displaying the Wazala uh, button widget up at the top of your page. So just paste the embed code from your clipboard here in the custom analytics field and then click save. Alright, so once you log out of your site, you'll be able to see the Wazala widget um, that we just added and people can now make purchases through your site, so pretty cool. Now, going back over to Wazala, the second way to add the shopping cart is to actually embed the widget right on your page. So under type, we'll pick the embed option this time and pick the language you'd like to showcase it in. Those are really your only options when you're embedding. Um, you'll now just want to go down and copy the entire embed code again and then go back over to your site. I've added a page called store, which I'll go to right here. And then once your page loads up, you want to add the embed HTML app to your page. And then go ahead and click edit content on the app. And then when your page slides over, highlight all the default content there, and then paste the Wazala embed code um, from your clipboard again. You want to click save and then close out and then you'll have to refresh your page and once you do that you'll see your shopping cart display right there on your page which will allow your visitors to browse and purchase products right from your site so it's a pretty nice um, little integration that you can do there with Wazala. Um, we'll be adding some additional tutorials soon covering other shopping cart options that you may have so definitely stay tuned. Thanks again.